Hi folks, Bob Dale from Jackson Lee Sales from Jackson, Mississippi. Where we sell motorhomes, we sell lots of them, we sell them only on eBay. Every once in a while folks, we buy a motorhome that is beyond the pale, that's just too different, it's too new, it's too something that's it's just very difficult to describe. Generally, we buy only bank repossessions, and 99% of our motorhomes are, but occasionally something else came, came, comes along. At the last bank repo sale in Texas, they were selling an estate, and we bought this motorhome out of an estate. This gentleman had it. He was an older gentleman. He had it for years. He had completely redone it to go, used to go to NASCAR. It's absolutely astonishing. They tell us that he spent, they uh, set it to sale, they had tickets, he'd spent $85,000 on this thing. We don't have the tickets. But we don't have tickets, we don't have any of that. That's what they said. And it's pretty evident that tens and tens of thousands of dollars were spent restoring and making this motorhome what it is today. Let us show it to you. It is a 91 holiday. Rambler. It's a Holiday Rambler Imperial. This motorhome has a Ford engine, folks, with only 50-something thousand miles on it. They put a new generator in it, a more modern generator. They put an Onan 7000 generator, 7000 kW generator in it. It only has 700 hours on it. It has a dome satellite, a track satellite system. That's out, that, that works. We're going to show you it works. It has flat screen TVs. It is set up for touring. It is set up for going to events. We like it. We hope you will. And by the way, they also had it painted with full body paint, which you know is fifteen, twenty thousand dollar option minimum. Come here and look at it right here. We'll show it to you if I can get this phone cut off. Hold on just a second. Okay, let me start here, folks. Look at the, the windshield. It's perfect on both sides. See the paint? Full body paint. Can you step back, son, and show what it looks like, this look to it? It has, it has a great look to it. Matter of fact, it looks like a uh, Santa Fe Limited or something to be, but it's a, it's a 91 Imperial, as I said. See down the side, there's absolutely no, no D-Lamb of any kind. It's a brand new set of tires. I'm talking about just brand new set of tires. No telling how many thousands of dollars. Full body paint. See all this? Let me see, it's got the escape door in it. You can see here, new leather seats, flex steel seats, jacks, the whole nine yards. We'll go inside and show you all that. But I want you to look at how beautiful this thing is. We've not done anything to it, folks. This is just the way we got it. Uh, we rinsed it off after driving it 500 miles home. That's a new hot water heater with gas and electric. That's it's, wheels too, isn't it, son? Well, of course it's wheels. I mean, it's got eight of them. <laughs> what, what, what else you call them? All right, I got had to unlock this door so I could show you the generator. It's an Onan Marquee Gold generator. You can see it's Batteries got two. Got I don't know what the date is, but they look new. Uh, Napa dual purpose premium marine heavy duty batteries. You can see it's got the, I'd say those are at least 98%. Now, somebody will come and bitch about well, it and no, find something to nitpick, but they're damn near new. Uh, it does have 50 amp shore power. You can run both AC units at once. It's got the uh, valve so you can back flush the holding tanks. And that's a uh, 10 gallon hot water heater. It's brand new with uh, gas and electric heat. I can't get over how pretty this paint is. Now before you, before somebody comes folks, let me show you. There's a scratch right here on this bumper. There is a little crazing right here. There's one uh, right here. And a little crazing right here on the bumper. Looks like they've kind of scratched something there. Otherwise, this this motor home is absolutely uh, It's got a, um, I would guess, new or like new Michelin tire back here. It's probably never been down. Never been down. Got air. 
thing is too pretty for words. Those look like tail lights off a Mustang GT. Those are both big storage compartments run almost all the way across. And look how pretty they are. Uh, how clean they are. Got the original fail in them. You can see the tires. Look at the frame. There's no rust. There's no nothing. They this is the aluminum exterior. It's yeah. not fiberglass. Look at this awning. Uh, that awning is fault. I guess this awning's been replaced, hasn't it? That's your original color. Well, it's got the sun, the metal shade to protect it. And you can see up top there's the track vision dome satellite up on the roof. And it's got two separate receivers for the front and rear LCD TVs. It's a 37 foot Imperial, folks, if you're wanting to look it up. That won't show you anything, but it'll show you well a 97 Imperial without this money spent on it. Brings to $15,000. Come on in, folks. We've got it on shore power. The air is ice cold. They will show you all this up here. It's only got, like I say, 50 something thousand miles on it. Look what a job they did with this leather. This is a Crown Imperial. It's not your regular Imperial. So it's got, I'll crank the engine. You can see the engine runs perfect. There's no exhaust leaks. It's got the electronic climate control, Alpine CD player, backup camera. It's got all the different gauges and switches. And up here is your uh, sharp color TV. Now, since I turned the engine on, it went off but I'll cut the engine back off and it'll come back on. We've also got a ton of keys. I got the key on, but you can't hear it, but it's got an alarm system with the remote so you can chirp it and make it beep. That's a sharp Aquas LCD or plasma TV. Hey son, before you get back to that, show me the seats. I mean, These seats have been replaced or recovered one, and probably that's replaced. Some expensive money. Feel that leather. That's the ultra leather seats. The dash is perfect, folks. Not a crack, not a not anything in this dash. It's been inside. I mean this thing's been uh, kept garage. It's got an ultra leather sofa, ultra leather ultra leather lounge chair. This table folds up. Underneath that box is a big subwoofer. It goes to the entertainment system. You can see the satellite controls. Um, I don't know what that does, but we got tons of remotes. This is a um, sharp digital home theater with DVD player. There's one in the front and in the back for separate systems. You got all your controls up here for your battery, outside humidity, temperature, all your levels. The only thing in here that might be original is these seats. That's been recovered. They've been recovered too. I mean, it's the original Corian countertops. Um, these, these seats are packed. Here is the. That's probably the original parquet wood flooring. Man, that's it. Got a got an ice maker. Uline ice maker. You can see these Philips surround sound speakers are. Stowed throughout the coach. Never leak, can't leak, and all that. Uh, here, this, folks, is a good idea for what he wanted to do, I guess. This is a heavy duty stain. It's a Viking, isn't it? Yeah. It's a Viking disposal. God knows what that cost, but it was $150,000. $150, but it cost something. Now, here is a uh, barest uh, something coffee maker stainless steel. It has the uh, magic shelf here. We're gonna keep that on. Uh, the coffee pot. That may not come with this. Uh, that's a high dollar. It microwave works. Before everybody calls and asks me, it does not have a stove. It has a microwave. Uh, and that's it. Refrigerator freezer here. That's, ice cold. It's been replaced. That's not the original refrigerator no, no, that, that came with it. It's a it's later brand model unit. New and ice cold. They did some cabinetry work in this that's absolutely cool. Look at all this. Now this closet you can see back here is pre-plumbed and wired. If you want to add a washer and dryer combo or even a full stacked unit, you can put one in here. All the lights come on. Now this door sun here. Let me raise this up. Comes back for privacy and why. That's a real door. Uh, come in here. You can see here's some. Here's your track vision back here, son. 
for your satellite. In this hall closet, I'll flip this up so we can close it. There's your other uh, track vision rear controller, your rear entertainment system controller. Here's more closet space in this hall. Close this door. I want you to look what a bathroom. Let's so swing good. around. It's got a uh, porcelain toilet, Corian countertop. You can see no leaks. It's got a glass shower. No leaks around the skylight. It does have a tub with a uh, seat on it, so if you're old and contrary, you can sit down and I, I know, ponder, I, I get the, and, ponder and I the unfairness of life. I don't need that, but there is no unfairness in life. What happens is you have children who try to badger you around, and I won't tolerate it. Now this this is a big working. this is a big U-shaped dinette. Now we've got it converted to the bed, but you can look at this. Flip these cushions up. <laughs> and put this mount this table onto it makes a table here's your here's your stands for the table and this is all been of course redone it's comfortable i'm gonna beg you this is a comfortable bed and here's your surround sound see the surround sound speakers here. throughout the rear aquas television with sound bar what is this subwoofer uh big speaker system there's your home theater dvd player set up um, does have a nice privacy screen. Both the front and rear air conditioners are run off real thermostats. They're not on or off like what would have originally been in here. They they have thermostats on them. Well, light city work. I'm telling you folks, these folks are uh, were not youngsters and they wasn't poor people and they stood in front of God and everybody and said the old man spent eighty five thousand dollars redoing this motor home. Now. That said, who would know? I, I, what would that full body paint cost? Twenty grand? Fifty nine nine ninety five. Well, I know we get some, but uh, I, based on what these painters ask us to paint on these a bumper, I would imagine it would cost two million dollars to paint this full body paint. Well, notice when they redid the dinette, they redid all these window shades to match the dinette fabric, and added the wood blinds wood too. Blinds. Which I, I, man, I like those so much more than those, those you know, shades, lines. those things. Yeah, I hate those. They always stay torn up. That's your diagnostic port for the satellite. You can plug in and see what's happening with it. Now you can, this wood door will close completely off so you don't have to use that screen. You can just block the whole back this end off. Looks, this thing looks like, folks, when you're in it, it looks like a lodge, doesn't it? It, had, it has this paneling. It's light looking. I mean, it looks like a someone has built a lodge. It, well, in 91, a Crown Imperial cost more than just the, most diesels did. I mean, it's, well, if, it's if, the if, high end. Okay. Well, you know, we, we got it. We're going to have a low reserve anyway. But let's, let's assume that, that if we just had a nice 91 Crown Imperial with 50,000 miles on it, without all this other spin on it, it would bring, what, 15 grand? Well, the last one we had about two years ago brought um, 23 or four, so it would bring at least 20. And, and be that's, nice. That's without this done, folks. Now, we're not gonna, you're not going to have to pay all that for this thing, so don't worry about it. But we're just talking about what they're worth. This cabinetry work, and we go through this, folks. They'll ask us $800 at a body shop to paint a bumper. That's why I say, and of course Dan's uh, castigating me for it, but Dan, uh, I was saying, gosh knows what they charge you to do a full body paint on this in most colors. I mean, it would be astonishing. I mean, I, I'm going to promise you in the, the, in the $20,000 plus range. And you can see from looking up, look, there's, I mean, the ceilings are, are perfect. Uh, there's your antenna. And and there's everything the TV antenna works. still in it. Not that you use it. See the dome satellite does work. We've got it dialed into direct TV. Dan's got it so long ago he was going to the menu. It does, in fact, work. It is absolutely, folks, we're, we're approaching. We've sold over at nearly 1,050 motorhomes and six, seven years, and this is just about the coolest one we've ever had. Now, that said, I'm the kind of person who would rather have uh, uh, a 2000 Cadillac, a nice 2000 Cadillac, is a 2000, 
and uh, and and Park Team in Powell. But I just think this thing is absolutely so perfect, and it makes. And I, and let me use something that's not trite, but it makes a statement. When you see it, you drive up, it just looks so cool. Now, I'm trying to figure out something cute to say to my remark that it makes a statement, but it does. I don't and, want you to have another breakdown. Okay, all right. Anyway, I like it a lot. I like it as good as any motorhome we've ever had. We've sold them for $100,000 plus. Anyway, we're going to list it. It is a 91. Holiday Rambler Imperial. Crown Imperial. Crown Imperial. Crown Imperial. It's got a Ford engine. I'm trying to cover all the bases. A Ford engine with only 50 something thousand miles on it. And it's a fuel injected V8 with overdrive. It's not an old carbureted one either. Right. So you can run it 70 down the highway if you want it, to. It, the generator has been changed out. It has a 7,000 kW Onan generator in it. It has about 700 hours on it. It has a track fish and satellite system, and it has a new set of tires that I know we're going to get. Dan says, I said it's like new. Dan said 98%. If they're not 95%, don't argue, just don't bid on it if that's going to be an issue because they're, they're, they're like new. You saw them, they still got the tits on them and everything. It's got full body paint. You saw the awning, which is beautiful and immaculate. You saw the compartments. There's nothing to pick on it, folks. The people said they spent $85,000. I hate to be redundant about that. I don't know the amount, but you can look at this motorhome from inside, outside, any way you want to, and you can see where they spent a gosh awful amount of money. And I can assure you, you'll never find another one like it. There's not one like this in the United States. The leather has all been redone. The kid leather, the, the, the dinette has, has all been recovered. They matched the fabric throughout all the balances around the windows and all that. It has got beautiful wooden blinds throughout, Corian countertops. Uh, you saw in the back, that lounge area is, uh, that, that, that makes into a lounge or makes into a, a king size bed. That's all done in, in, in uh, Ultra leather. leather. And I can tell you this from having a seat upholstered, don't, don't ask me what it would cost to, to upholster all that. But anyway, it is a grand motorhome. There's not one like it anywhere, anytime, any place. Everything on it works. We drove it 500 miles home. We've driven it around here, and I assure you, I would not hesitate to start to Puyallup, Washington, or Bangor, Maine, or wherever you're from. It will go there. Uh, we're going. We, it, oh, I mentioned it has a track satellite system, uh, track vision. Anyway, it's a beautiful motorhome. It's unusual. It's a classic that you you can't duplicate. We'll list it and see what happens. By the way. Uh, don't hesitate. My name's Bob Dale. Don't hesitate to call and ask me about this motorhome because I'll tell you exactly what you can buy it for. And I promise you, if you want to buy it, we reserve the right to sell. This motorhome will never in any shape, form, or fashion see the end of the sale. And we don't try to do anything to eBay. We'll have you be high bidder, kill the sale, and leave each other feedback. But it will not see the end of the sale. So my name's Bob Dale. My phone number is 601-218-1223. 601-218-1223. If you want to buy this motorhome, give me a call. If you have a question about it, give me a call. I can shut the phone off. Uh, I will be Damn, glad man. to. I throw it me Hold on. If you're if you're interested in this fun, uh, motorhome, <laughs> if you're interested in this motorhome, give me a call. 601-218-1223. If you want to buy it, give me a call. I'll tell you what we're going to take for it. And you will be surprised at how little we'll sell something that you really can't place a value on. You can't place a value on it, I assure you, if you was going to try to duplicate this motorhome. Anyway, we appreciate you bidding on our motorhomes. We appreciate you looking at them. We really, really appreciate our many hundreds and hundreds of customers around the world, folks. And we look forward to seeing you here in Jackson, Mississippi. Thank you.